former rival shipping lines, China Ocean Shipping Group Company, Costco, and China Shipping Group have come together to form China Costco Shipping Corporation, which will control one of the world's largest fleets of dry bulk vessels, container ships, and oil tankers. The new line, acronym COSCOX, joins the fray during one of the leanest times for shipping firms. Maritime consultancy Drury says the global container shipping industry will make a combined loss of $5 billion this year. Shipping firms have gone through years of losses since the global financial crisis brought the shipping boom to an end, as new vessels ordered before the downturn have created an oversupply and driven down freight rates to record lows. The new company's chairman told staff that there would be no salary cuts or layoffs, a policy operated by many Chinese state-owned firms, but which industry insiders said makes no sense. Coscox employs 180,000 workers, more than double the workforce of Maersk. It owns 830 vessels, including container ships, dry bulk vessels and tankers, nearly twice the combined fleet of Maersk and Mitsui OSK, according to reports. According to some experts, Coscox's massive size works to its advantage as it allows it to compete more strongly for market share than if it had remained two separate companies making continuing losses. However, the merger does again threaten the existing makeup of vessel sharing alliances on container routes, which firms have entered to lower costs. We'll bring you more on shipping lines, mergers, and alliances when we have it.